We're at McGregor Community Center uh, located at Lawrence and Kennedy. This is a very active, functional um, community center for the youth. The Dorset Park um, Youth Council was formed in 2007 for the purpose of helping the community. Well, I play as the co-chair for this group and um, help um, organize and mobilize the youth that all started with a simple politics project to do something positive. And they just told me to go out and try to have a plan of what you want to change in this community. And my resource is right beside my school. It's this community center right here. Youths need to be engaged, need to have a space of their own in here. And that's what inspired me in the first place. I came from Iraq in 2002, around 2003, and that was the time of war. Um, it was around 11, 12. I faced many barriers. Most important one was the English barrier, able to communicate. And if you don't have English, um, it's difficult to um, get a job and continue with education. Other than that, it was um, being able to f support myself and my family. And especially, I can speak on behalf of my father, how it was difficult for him as well. My number one inspiration is my father. You know, he's my guiding star, basically. He paved the way for me. Whether it's the work, he taught me discipline, or whether it's my dream of what I want to become. It's, it's how he painted the world for me and inspired me to, to do well. That's why I'm doing That's why who I am today. As a part of the selection committee, I did get to meet Carrer, but I didn't get an opportunity to talk to him since he was notified that he, in fact, is this year's recipient. Hi, Carrer. So this was an absolute great opportunity to meet him in an environment that was so much more comfortable. This is his area. This is my sister. Your sister. Oh, so you're a big brother. Oh, wow. So how old were you when you came here? When I, was, when I came here, I was 11 years old find it very difficult for a young person because I didn't have any English. So you didn't speak any English at all? No, no, no. Oh, that must have been... I understood a couple of words. It's a great project that we've been working on for two years now. Wow. And uh, David Miller, as you see here. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I see David, yeah. He came to support us also in these pictures as well. To come here and see what he has accomplished I see what he's done, I've seen the basketball court, and, and you really see that he has such a passion for how he gives back to his community. Young people, you know, have a lot of stress on their own. It's difficult to engage them, but you have to show them a different vision. It's a vision that they have to really establish themselves. This award is an absolute natural fit to the core values at Xerox. Uh, we certainly value uh, youth, we value diversity. It's all of the things that make us unique. And I like to think of it as not different from me, but different like me, because we're all different. I would like to really thank them for acknowledging the person that I am, coming as a newcomer to this country. So the advice that I would give for newcomers is um, to go out there and engage themselves in programs, in, in school, with friends, so that's where they're able to see the new life that awaits them in this country. And the recipient of this year's New Pioneer Youth Award is Karar Jafar.